Hey, I'm tired. I'm still not recovered from the road trip. How we doing? Okay. It's starting to make sense now what people say in regards to Ohio weather. That it's uh, that it's nice in terms of like temperature during this time, but it's like gloomy. Prototypical overcast, gloomy, but it's like it's not cold. The first morning I was here, it was it was like cold. I wasn't really used to it. Now, now it's okay. Not much to do. We're still in preseason right now, so there's not a whole lot going on. For me, I was actually gonna supposed to throw in like a uh, inner squad today, but I pushed it back because my nail ripped the other day. And then I had to go get an acrylic nail, like a fake nail. This happens all the time. I have a YouTube segment on this. So what happens is I, I this, this happens often, but it hasn't happened in a while, cracking my nail like that. Um, so what happens is I gotta get a fake nail just to reinforce it. But it's tough because it takes a while, maybe like a couple days to get used to in terms of like feeling comfortable with throwing the ball. So that's why I didn't want to pitch today. <sighs> my routine right now is actually pretty nice. I uh, go to the field, get my work in, hang with the guys, come home, sit at the desk and uh, crush it for about, I don't know, four hours, hop on the scooter, scoot around town, get really weird looks, go find food, show you the field, show you the stuff that I do there. We'll capture the dream together. All right, guys, let's do this. See ya. Okay, whoa, my mic's turned backwards. So, can't uh, can't show you the clubhouse. Dudes are changing. So, what I can do is show you the field as I walk on it barefoot. That's way better. Look at this, right? That's second base. Okay, um, I'm gonna flip the camera around and I'm gonna show you the field from the loneliest spot in the world. All turf. All turf. I don't really like it, but it is what it is. Yesterday I had to go to Dick's Sporting Goods to get a pair of shorts because the shorts that we have here don't have pockets in them. And holy smokes, you need pockets, especially when you carry around as much stuff as I do. Let's run you through What's uh? What do I bring out to the field on a typical day? Oh. Glove. Actually, a 360. Bands. Jump rope. Shorty. Rhino rope. Eight, seven ounce. Clean flag. Five, eight ounce. Resistance bands. Plyos. Wrist weight. One kilo. A little drink. Okay, let's get to work.
gonna be nice and a little warm too. Appreciate it. Yep. What do you think, man? Stuff look good, man. Does uh, the purple bring out the color of your eyes? I got blue eyes. So All right. I think so. <laughs> I like that glove. Okay. Just got done throwing recovery phase. Sure. In honor of Kobe. Oh. Try that again. Never missed him. It's the best one, right? It really is. Because it's like I don't old. like any of the other. It shows hate, you everything. I everything hate, I need I to know. I hate the other one. Time, date, weather. Yeah. How lazy I've been. <laughs> That's definitely on there for me too. All right. Yo, boy. Locker swag. Okay, so what I do is I gotta film everyone's locker so I can get all their names and then follow them on Instagram. Cause I'm kind of, it's like my pet peeve if someone follows me and I don't follow them back. Uh, I feel bad and I, and I don't wanna be that guy. So I gotta get all the names and then I can search them and follow them. Okay, so indie ball, minor league, gotta be resourceful. And what I mean by being resourceful is taking advantage of the opportunities to get free stuff. Okay. So down at the field, it's 1247, which means I can get back to the hotel, crush a protein shake, and then get ready and mentally prepped to do desk work. I think I'm gonna have a couple of clients today signed up for analysis. And so if they turned in their videos, then I can work with them, but I need to make, need to make headway on the book. I hit a, hit a chapter yesterday, but a lot more work needs to be done on it. Cause as soon as I get it done, it's still going to take a lot of time to do the marketing stuff for it. Um, so it's almost, uh, more time consuming. I will catch you guys back at the hotel in a bit. All right, so now we work at the desk, fire it up. I need to go get some sort of caffeine. I've been going downstairs and uh, there's this conference room 
I don't know what it's particularly used for. I don't see anyone in it. You guys want to just go right now? No. It's usually the coffee thing right there. Excuse me, is there uh, any way I can get a coffee? Like, uh, do you guys have any like coffee I could pour into this cup? Uh, we don't have any, no, we don't have any made coffee. Oh, That's okay, no made coffee. Yeah, is there a way I can get some more uh, for the room? Yeah, please. Uh -huh. Thank you. Perfect, thank you so much. You have a good one. Show you guys fix. That's where I go at night and do my, do like a little walk and then do some mobility. But you guys shall see that tonight. I don't even know if you guys are gonna see from down there. Okay. I gotta put my clothes away today. I don't know where these are gonna go. Oh, that smells amazing. I gotta use this. The hotels now, they don't have bags in the trash. I don't know if it's like an environment thing, but it's kind of annoying, if I'm being honest. Ketones, ketone aid, ketone esters, big fan. Tastes like trash though. Oof, that's tough. But the things we do for performance, you know? I gotta take this pop socket thing off this. I dropped my phone today. Watch. First thing right when I walked into the clubhouse. See it? Oh yeah, tough. Tough. Because uh, I don't, I don't use a case with this because the the tripod holder thing that it's in, the case doesn't fit because that case right there has a pop socket on it. So I gotta put the case on, take the pop socket off. So this thing just brewed. One cup of Joe or bean, whatever you want to use, and this is the setup. I gotta switch it up because. Yesterday, well, yesterday I put protein powder in the coffee. <laughs> it didn't, it didn't turn out good. We'll go collagen peptides. Creatine, monohydrate. Stevia, I need to do another round of Stevia. That's what I gotta do today. I gotta order a bunch of stuff on Amazon. I need a blender. I have a whole list. These frothers right here, lifesaver. Amazing. Okay, got the creatine and that mixed up. Now we go L-theanine. I only do, so this is a 200 milligram pill. I only do about 100, so half. And then I do another 100 before bed. And then we take fish oil and CDP choline. I take a lot of I take a lot of supplements for brain function, cognitive function, brain health, all those things. I need it for when I do my desk work. So that's what like the L-theanine's for, that's what the CDP choline, fish oil obviously is brain and performance benefits, creatine, collagen, same thing. A lot of brain benefits, cognitive function with uh, creatine. A lot of good stuff coming out. Couldn't be any hotter. Holy heck. So, now we grind. We'll uh, probably won't catch you guys later until, let's see, I'm gonna work for probably three and a half hours. So put me around 4.35, and then that's when I'll hop on the scooter, go get food. I do gotta go shopping. Nah, well yeah, because I'll do Amazon order, but I also gotta go get like, some fruit for smoothies so I can have like a protein shake with blueberries, but we're limited on freezer space. <laughs> okay, 
That's it. That's what I got. I'm going to sit down, get to work. Catch you guys later tonight. Whoa, holy smokes. That turned out to be a very busy, very busy afternoon. So it's 7 o'clock, 7.09 to be exact, East Coast time. Speaking of East Coast time, I'm still not adjusted to the time zone. I realize that when I lay in bed um, and I guess when I eat because California, it's three hours behind. I get in bed, I'm not tired at all, and it's like 11, 30, 12. When I'm in California, when I'm home, I'm not playing, I'm in bed by nine, like sleeping. So gotta get used to that. Um, could be much in large part to the amount of time sitting at the desk staring at the screen. Anyways, it got busy because apparently today was the last day, last day to file my uh, tax, taxes and stuff. And it's a learning process for me because I got drafted 18 and I had a financial advisor and he did everything. I didn't really learn all that stuff. And then now as a entrepreneur, it's a completely different dynamic and I'm learning as I go. There's a bunch of stuff I had to fill out, figure out. I had to do like mileage and car reimbursements and food and all this stuff for when I travel. It's it's crazy. There's there's a lot to it. I'm, gonna, I'm stuck between deciding on if I should uh, go do like my, my nighttime mobility stuff and, and walk and stuff like that in the weight room first before I eat or if I should eat. Now the thing is I'm not that hungry so uh, who cares right I'm probably just gonna go walk and if I see something that sounds tasty I'll eat it but if not then at least I gotta walk in anyways gotta go I'll uh, I'll definitely bring you guys along when I do go into the uh, the hotel weight room I'll show you guys what I do in there okay talk to you guys later all right dudes I lied I ended up just going straight to the weight room and got in some uh, some uphill on the treadmill magic. I'm actually going to get tacos right now. You guys want to roll with me? I'm actually going to try to set you up on the scoop piece. Headphones, check. Room key, check. Mask, fanny pack, you better believe it. Here we go. All right, you guys go in this thing. Well, I tried, didn't work. And I don't have the screwdriver either because there needs to be a screwdriver thingy that fits that little octagon or whatever shape that is, or else it'll just keep going like this. And you know, if it goes down and you hit a bump, phone, vlog, everything's ruined. So got some tacos and a bowl from this place. I also went to the front desk and your boy got some cookies. It's a big bag. All right, so we got a bowl. I don't know, I just threw some stuff in it. Honestly, the menu made it sound like the tacos were the go-to. What is that, dude? They got like this thing running. Oh, you can't see it. They got this thing like running all over the place. Can you see that? Oh. Oh, that is sensational. It's four circles. It's not even Tuesday. Mm. Holy cow. <laughs> that is so good. Wow, is this a different one? Oh, wow. It's the sauce. It's like a... What is it, a chipotle aioli lime or something? Aioli lime or something, I don't know. I wonder if everyone's just watching this just grossed out right now, or if they're just super hungry and on their way to get tacos. One negative of this place, I will say, is um, it's a dollar extra to put beans on it. I've never heard of a Mexican food restaurant charge have an upcharge for beans all right dudes i'm out it is 9 32 i'm gonna wind down um okay so that was that was a vlog good day of a vlog um subscribe um i won't do another vlog until like my schedule changes because i feel like it kind of just gets boring like if i did a vlog of this 
this has been the, the same every day. Uh, I didn't show you my, my nightly gym routine though, so I don't know. But I'll wait until things change, which they should be changing. I should be changing sometime this week. I'll uh, throw an inner squat on Tuesday, and then I think the next time I tow it up will be in the, in the, in the season, in a game. So once season starts, I'll definitely be doing more vlogs, show you the home routine, show you the routine on the road. Just things change all the time, so it'll be a lot easier to vlog then. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry the scooter vlog didn't work out. I was really excited for that. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your day, night, morning, whenever you're watching this, I suppose. Until next time, love you.